Hello Pisces, welcome. Weekly love title reading. Welcome, let's get started. What a dramatic music, guys. Now, let me reshuffle my deck and let me see, guys, what will happen with you and with your love life. And let me see how this partner of yours feels for you during this week. By the way, guys, I hope every single one of you are safe and sound. Now, let me see what is going on with you. Okay, Pisces, you are healed. Oh, you are still need to heal, to mend your heart. But guys, you know, chains, problems, you know, suffering, you know, crying is going away, honey. Either you already healed or honey, you still need, you know, a couple of weeks or days to heal your heart completely. You look like a person who is so good. Your heart is a golden heart. Honey, don't allow yourself, you know, other people, you know, playing with you. You can see finally no problem of some kind is going away. It's going away. Okay, guys, I need more tarot cards to see, you know, what this healing is all about. I hope you already healed. Yep, honey, you are already healed. Now, if you're attached, your current partner uh, needs to say something to you. Could be an apology. Could be like, you know, we need to talk, honey, you know. But your current partner will realize your reasons why and what you're saying, you know. And, you know, the way even, you know, you are talking with your partner. Guys, let me tell you one thing. Your partner loves you. Your partner is not ready to leave you. No, 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 no. I only can see smiling faces. Smiling faces. So maybe you have something to say on their account. And, you know, they will say to you, you know, yeah, but why you are doing that, you know? Maybe you are tired or guys, you know, overwhelmed with something, you know? And your partner will say, well, don't do that then, you know. But you will reply, yeah, but someone needs to do that, you know. Could be like, you know, domestic, you know, things, you know, or whatever. You know? Now, let me see. Take the lead, honey. Take the lead and, you know, simply love your partner just the way they are. Take the lead. Lead your partner, guys. I think this is you. I don't think this is your partner. I think... I think you will lead your partner by listening your partner. Simply apply what your partner is saying to you. So guys, you see, you see, this is not bad at all. For those of you who are single, for those of you who are single, now let me see. There is a person, guys, mm, I must say, some of you are um, liking someone or maybe you're already in a relationship with a person who is attached. And I mean it, you know. So some of you are waiting divorce of this person. Or maybe, honey, this is you getting a divorce. So you can live your life the way you want to live your life. So some of you are in a period of waiting. Because, you know, you must wait for a piece of paper. Or maybe to see this person uh, in a real life again, maybe you don't live with this boyfriend or girlfriend of yours, you know, depends on the private story. Now, ten of wands, no more waiting, no more waiting, you know, uh, many of you will set the uh, the deadline, you know, like, like, you know, this is you setting, uh, you know, the date, saying, you know, okay, okay, I'm giving you, like, you know, the end of May or, you know, whatever, you know, and then, you know, I will do, you know, whatever you want to do. So, Aries Leo Sag want to talk to you. This could be your ex, I think, if I'm not mistaken. And honey, everything depends only on you. If you want to stay, stay. If you want to go back, 
go back. If you want to be single for some time, stay single. But you need to balance your thought because guys, you know, uh, throughout, you know, this week, you will change your mind, you know, many, 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 many times, you know. So if you're single, I can see triggers, not one, but many of them. You can meet uh, Cancer uh, and, uh, and Scorpio, Aries and Sag, you know, someone who just broke in their relationship and then you will be, you know, so happy. But be careful, be careful, because most likely this person is not completely over this person, like in an emotional sense, okay? So you need to go slow. You need to go slow. For those of you who are already attached, there is a big, 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 beautiful level of understanding between you and your partner. Five of Wands, pushing and pulling, going, you know, backwards and forwards. You said this. No, I didn't. You have done to me. No, I did not. You know, this is five of, you know, Wands. This is also ego struggle. Honey, let it go don't use your energy too much say your peace and leave say your peace and leave honey and i'm not saying you know doesn't have to be only your spouse or partner this could be your colleague or friend or maybe even a family member okay honey remember you have your reasons and they have their reasons remember keyword for this week is balance balancing when you should talk and balancing when basically you should listen or simply to be quiet generally speaking i really really think that your love partner loves you i really think that you will get more power and more love in this week because you know something is opening Nine of Pentacles, honey, extremely good for money, extremely good for job, for continuing your career. This is some money. And if you don't have a job, take the lead. Talk with your recruiter because your recruiter can find you a real a lucrative job. But this is a love reading. Capricorn Virgo Taurus is perfect match for you whether this is your current partner or whether this is someone that you will meet i don't think this is completely new person i think you know this person for quite some time maybe a couple of years and this person quite very easily could be your colleague Pisces. <coughs> i told you now didn't i edis leo's edge is in your life or trying to get back to you or trying to talk to or trying to manipulate you you know with you but you are tough cookie honey you are tough cookie you know nobody can talk you into something that basically you do not want but oh i'm saying as you said probably is coming back at least for some of you now knight of swords and finally the end of story, I mean, in a sense, the end of calculation, the end of uh, fight, the end of ego struggle. So, guys, you see, your story is clearing with every single new tarot card. So, you are healing, you are getting much more stronger, you will take the lead, your partner will be so supportive towards you in case you have any kind of you know, misunderstanding emotional chaos is clearing and this is you saying ah okay now i hold the reins of my life finally in my hands so guys you know i have a sense you know that you are setting completely new love rules oh my we have a match we have a match queen of swords and knight of swords this is a match but there is a storm. Storm could be negative and storm could be positive. I think it will be positive with your current partner or maybe meeting someone completely new. Now, maybe you know, maybe you do not know. There is a person who is secretly in love with you. Do you want to know their zodiac sign? Do you? 
Okay, then let me tell you. Libra, Gemini. Leo, Sagittarius, Scorpio or Taurus. Secretly in love with you. How about that? Pisces, comment, like, share and subscribe on my channel. God bless you all.